Will you be taking the COVID-19 vaccine? For millions of people around the world, the answer is no. It's true that science has studied the effects of the vaccines and there should be very little concern about its safety. But most vaccines take 10 to 15 years to develop. Is there any danger that this is happening too fast? Can getting the COVID-19 vaccine alter your DNA? Can it cause any serious harm? <laughs> and what happens in your body after you get the jab? So, should you be scared of the COVID-19 vaccine? First up, a little background. There are over 170 COVID-19 vaccine candidates being developed around the world. But the two main ones come from Moderna and Pfizer. They're both known as mRNA vaccines, a vaccine variation that has never been widely distributed and works differently from other vaccines. Not only that, but these vaccines began being researched sometime in April of 2020 and were approved in December of the same year. So, naturally, people are a bit worried about seeing them come out so fast. Let's break down exactly why people are scared of the COVID-19 vaccine. And by the end, we'll have a definitive answer on whether or not you should be scared. Fear number one, this vaccine will alter my DNA. Why some people believe this claim is for a few reasons. First, a viral video from an osteopath, Carrie Madej, made the false charge that because this vaccine is an mRNA vaccine, it will change people's DNA. mRNA works like a piece of code that your body reads to handle the virus. It works like any other vaccine in the sense that it's meant to trigger an immune response by training our bodies to recognize and fight the virus. But this type of vaccine is much safer because where a regular vaccine would inject you with a weakened or inactive germ in order to get your body to build an immunity, mRNA is just providing your body with information to fight and prevent COVID-19. There's no virus, living or dead, contained in the vaccine. Fear number two. This vaccine was made too quickly. These COVID-19 vaccines were developed in less than a year. And since other vaccines have taken 10 to 15 years to be developed, there must be something wrong with these ones, right? Well, not exactly. Scientists were able to develop these vaccines so quickly because of years of previous research related to other viruses. Not only that, but due to the enormous funding these projects got, multiple trials were able to run, allowing companies to move faster than ever before. And because these vaccines are mRNA, they don't use any part of the COVID-19 virus. This has allowed the vaccine development to be much less dangerous and, as a result, a lot faster than ever before. Fear number three. I've heard vaccines in general are dangerous. It's no secret that a lot of people are afraid of vaccines. Experts say more than 60% of new parents can feel some sort of hesitation when it comes to vaccinating their children. People are worried about side effects like diseases, autism, or maybe even death. But generally, when things like this do happen, it's not due to the vaccine, but other factors at play. 
And in the case of the COVID-19 vaccination, it should be noted that tens of millions of doses have been administered. And of those doses, the majority of people haven't experienced any severe side effects. <coughs> yeah, some people have had allergic reactions, but the vast majority of people have been fine. And of course, it's natural to be a little worried about the long-term consequences of the vaccine. These are just simply questions we don't have answers to yet. But the more people that take the vaccine, the more scientists can learn about the safety and the side effects of it. So if you're still a bit worried about the COVID-19 vaccine, here are some more tips to put you at ease. The COVID-19 vaccine is new, yes, and we often fear things that we don't know much about. Continue to do more research on the subject. Get your info from trusted sources like Johns Hopkins Institute, the CDC, and others. And please, always take clickbait headlines with a grain of salt. So, should you be scared of the COVID-19 vaccine? We are going to put it very low on our scarometer. This is because of all the research that has gone into it and the millions of vaccines that have already been administered. Also, who would want this vaccine to be sabotaged? The state of the world currently is helping no one. And this vaccine will hopefully get us back to normal as soon as possible. So how do you feel about the vaccine? Do you think you're going to get it? If you do, maybe we can all travel again. I'd love to go swim with some sharks. Now, some people say that those things can be pretty dangerous. Are they? Well, we'll let you know on the next episode of Should You Be Scared? <laughs>